What's up guys, this is Will Wee with PragerU and let's go over why Medicare for All won't work. First of all, it destroys innovation within the free market. If the government is the only provider of medical insurance, that means that the government are the ones setting the prices. That means that the only price that you're gonna get is from the government. Have you ever been to the DMV? You know how these people work? They don't care about you. They're bureaucrats who work for the government. You think that they're going to care much about the prices of your health insurance or care much about the quality? When you have health care that is run by the government, a bunch of bureaucrats, they are not going to spend your money wisely because they're not spending their own money. They're spending your money. So they don't care so much about how it's used. With all these different benefits that the government made you have in your Obamacare plan, it made costs skyrocket. You saw in Arizona that prices for health insurance actually doubled in a one year period. But what about my country of Sweden with my free health care? Doesn't work, okay? The only reason why these countries are able to do that is off the backbone of America. America far, far outpaces any country on amount of medical innovation spending. So with the medical innovation that comes in the free market of America, these other countries are then able to reap the benefits with their free healthcare system. If America were to adopt a Medicare for all system where we were no longer having medical innovation, the free market, you would see all these other countries' healthcare systems collapse because they're no longer getting the innovation that America produces. And let's say Medicare for all actually worked in America and everyone got a good plan and waiting rooms weren't so long like they are in the UK like they are in Canada with their Medicare for All programs, you still have just huge prices for this Medicare for All system. All these leftists and socialists say that you can just raise taxes on the rich, on the 1% on Wall Street. Well, what's going to happen when these rich people don't want to pay taxes for other people anymore? They're going to leave. And then who's going to foot the bill? That's going to be middle class Americans having to pay exorbitant costs for health care and poor people who then have to pay huge premiums for their own health care from the government. Even if taxes were doubled on every single American, every single American's taxes were doubled, you still wouldn't be able to afford a Medicare for All system in America. So let's go over this. Medicare for All destroys competition in the free market. It destroys medical innovation. And thirdly, it is too cost expensive to ever have in America. So when you hear leftists talk about Medicare for All or free health care for all, remind them that that is an anti-American idea and that we should be looking for freedom against government control. I'm Will Witt. Thanks for watching. What's up guys? I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, like, comment, and share this video with your friends and make sure that you follow me and PragerU on social media. Thank you for watching this video. To help keep PragerU videos free, please consider making a tax-deductible donation.